So I try to explain to un uneducated black people that some white people have a lot of troubles too. You know, you may not see it, but my dad had a very extreme mental illness that caused him not to be able to pr provide finances and locked him into a marriage he wasn't happy with because my mom had mental illness and there was no medicine. She would take Valium. It wasn't till many years later that they came out with Wellbutrin that she actually conquered her issues with agoraphobia and panic attacks. And poor thing, you know, I was mad at her, but she drank and smoked because she was having anxiety and it helped. And I think dad tried to understand, but it was just too much with his bipolar, um, you know, promiscuous things like that as a salesman. And nobody in the family wants to talk about the elephant in the room, but let me say, Jennifer's a controlling person. You know, and she's got some issues. I mean, I didn't do anything. She walked over and assaulted me when all I did was talk about my country western poor songs, the poor country cowboy songs of the heroin user and the alcoholic and then the, the nice one that died of leukemia. So it's just, she can't control it. And if she can't control it, she just wants to kill it. And you don't not, and I'm not good at weddings. You know, I don't do that bullshit. But, um, and Jennifer does, but still, if she's going to step up to the role of matron of the family, which she can't because I'm that person, and I may live in minimalist style with not much money as an artist, um, but that doesn't mean I don't have experiences that are very valuable to the family. Thank you.